guys, Gamers here with another video and today we are playing another episode of Ori and the Blind Forest Definitive Edition. How are you guys doing today? I hope you guys all enjoyed the last episode and please note I still lost quite a bit of my voice. It's not come back all the way yet. So do keep that in mind if I suddenly stop talking properly. That is probably why. I apologize up front for that. I'm probably going to die if I try this, but I wanted to see if there was anything there. Yeah, okay, okay, fine, I understand. Don't have to kill me over it, crikey. Oh well, I guess we are going up to the left and not the right. I wonder what we'll find here. Whoa! That looks amazing! No wonder Kira is avoiding this place. The sunstone still radiates the light that she fears. That's good, I guess. Oh wow, the volcano in the background. That's not good. Okay, so... I found the sunstone. Using this legendary rune, you can gain entrance to Mount Horu. Probably the volcano in the background. Ah, our home. What's going to happen here? Memories? Oh, the Gumon. Oh. oh my god, she's alive! Their journey inspired even he who had doubt. Gumo had found a place to belong. With the sunstone, we can now pass through Mount Horus gates, but do you feel the shaking, the rumbling in the earth? Mount Horus is close to spewing fire. There is no time to lose. Well, there is going to be time to lose, because I'm going to see, because I know that's the end of the game, I'm actually going to see if I can collect all secrets now. Because we've got all the major power-ups, we should be able to go everywhere and get everything in the entire game that's still left to get all points. We could surely use that in the final area because I know, I remember how challenging that was. So, the first thing we're going to do, most likely, is go down and see if we can get the energy point on the left there. We still haven't found the ground punk thing for that, so I hope we will. We got a new objective. Okay, to the left there's also nothing. We actually just have to go down. Wait, can we save here? Oh, I just did create a new save point. I thought that might have functioned as a save point somehow. Oh, it's still there. Oh, come on. I can do this. Do you need to press the soul link there? Okay, so... Oh, no, no. Please. Just let me down. Oh, great. You are fucking annoying. Oh, they kill each other. That's great. That's absolutely lovely. Maybe now we'll find the thing by accident. Maybe it's in here. No. Oh, that, didn't, that didn't seem logical anyway. Sure. Let's go down further. I know there's also some secrets here in this area somewhere at least. That's going to be off to the... Yeah, that isn't... Oh, that does still have a secret we can find. Ah, oh, we should do that. Okay, I guess this episode I'm not going to cut out stuff. It's just going to be a search. And searches make failure sometimes. 
You can't expect everything to be perfect in a search, can you? Yeah, we're going to have to go bottom left, bottom right, except that there's more secrets to be found. Which I guess it isn't, because that would have shown up by now. Whoops. My bad. Save here just to make sure. Just to make sure. Okay, nothing there. Didn't seem logical right away, but it will be. I know there is stuff up there, but I think we already got that. Yeah, we did. Because I can glide up here. Yeah, okay, that's that. And then we had the one to the right here. That should be relatively easy now. Because we know how to do this. Whoa, come on, cling there. Yep, we got that. That's an ability cell. Maybe we can already upgrade as well. Um, I really still would like the sensing ability, so I'm going to go for that. So I'll need that one. Next one also needs two, and then all but the last one needs two. So I'll need two more points for that. Now, can we quick travel to the spirit well? I don't know actually how we should do that. I don't actually know how we quick travel. I know you can, but that might just be just from spirit wells. I should look into that a bit, if I can. We actually need to go to the left for now. So we can get into the lost forest thing, Misty Woods, to get that last bit. So we can actually complete the Misty Woods. Did we complete... Sorrow Pass still has that one point there that bugs me to hell. I will find out before the next episode. I'm going to search it. I will find out how we get that. I promise I will. And we also have to go into the Black Borough Root uh, Deep Place thing when we have time. Is that something up there? Almost seems like it's too convenient to just be nothing. Okay. Maybe we can do it like that. Okay, it just limits you from going up there. Okay, that's fine. Not gonna worry about that. I guess there's not much here anymore to like really explore. Come on! Christ, you nearly killed me! Oh boy. Can we interact with this right now? Oh, we can actually ha head into there again. Oh wow, that is an interesting mechanic. That is interesting! We can actually re-go, re-enter the mystery part of this. Even though there's totally no use in that, because I think we got all of that. It's just some... All the way at the end there was a single piece we still needed to get. Whoops. I, oh, great! Great! Absolutely great. I'm losing so much health constantly. That lantern, and then further left... There should be... That last point somewhere here. Almost there. Yep, we needed that to really discover this. That's logical, we only find it now. Good eye achievement! I wonder what that achievement is for. We completed Misty Boots, that's great. Get away from me, you silly goose. There, you die. Because that gives me experience, that's lovely. That was probably the easiest to complete area. Because the Sorrow Pass also... Uh, still need that single bit, which I will once again Google at some point. The Valley of the Wind still has there down at the bottom. Still has something we could get. Well, let's see if we can. As quick as possible. Okay. So we can outrun that quite easily. 
destroy you. Just some extra experience. Just gets us to ability points faster. Always great to have them faster. Isn't it? Okay, so now... We can go left and out of this place again. Oh, come on, you butthurt! Quite literally. Let's get that life. We could well use that right now. I haven't really died in this episode much yet. That's surprising. Oh, come on. I did kill a lot of enemies. I wonder if I'll uh, end up below average or above average in the amount of deaths I take for this let's play. Kind of funny to know at least. Right? We should probably head to the volcano, but I don't think there's a specific time limit. Yeah, we can now head up here quite easily. So what we need to do is break that. And get another ability cell. I'm pretty sure we can now get another power-up. That one. Okay, we're actually getting pretty close to getting the ability to sense as well, which will help us quite a bit. So down here, there is no stuff in there that we seem to have missed. At least, there does seem to be something, because we have 98% in this and not a full 100%. But there is stuff up above there, is there? Huh, I wonder. At least, we need to go down left. Because there is a thing quite clearly there. Let's kill you just to make sure you don't kill me. Probably a good thing. So, nearly there. That is still a nothing. I wonder why that is there, because it does absolutely nothing. That is a map stone. Probably should save here just to make sure I keep up with everything. And that, can that be broken by me, or... No, it can't. How does that open? I wonder. Wait, could we use the green enemy for that? That'd be rather stupid if we missed that all along. Come on here. I'm sorry. I'm not going to be able to do that. At least not right now. That kind of seems like a gate I'd need to stomp on, but I don't really know a place here that has a piece I could actually stomp on. Wait, that would explain why that green one is there. Does that respawn? Let's see if it respawns. We kind of need that. If that's the thing we need, at least. Nah, it doesn't respawn. That's kind of sad. That seems like it could be an area of secret, but it isn't. Anything down here? Maybe? That's still a rogue. Can we break that? Yes, we can. Let's see what's here. Maybe the answer is here somewhere. Why cannot we pull that? That makes little sense. Okay. Any secrets here then? I already used those. Hmm. I'm just exploring and seeing if there could be anything. Oh, that actually smashes that. I didn't. Oh, that's why it was so hard for me to actually do this area because you could smash that and I didn't know. That's kind of silly. Okay. Could we actually head all the way into the ruins without any issues? Or will it block us from going there in some way, shape, or form? I do wonder. Yeah, we can still enter. And it is now always like that, so we can just walk around everywhere. That's interesting. 
Can we not head up there? What? Oh, we still need the orb for that, do we? Wait, but now we can actually get up by just playing through the level normally. Whoa, whoa, come on. Don't hurt me. I'm not here to hurt you. Well, I'm here to hurt you, but yeah. But that'll be a tricky wall jump now. Okay, that wasn't too hard. That's totally doable as well. That's probably a reason I still keep this accessible, even though you don't have the correct items to get through this. Huh. Wait, that seems like a weird place to do nothing in. Yep, we got something. I still want the sensibility so we can just see them. But I guess we're not quite there yet. There's no way I wouldn't have missed that, though. Okay, so that was quite easy. And this will likely be quite easy as well. I wonder how many places in here actually still contain secrets. I should probably go to the spirit well, though, and let's see if the teleportation actually does a thing. Wait, there is something up there. Okay, so that's where we came from. And to the right, there is the piece we actually want to take a look at, I think. Wait, did we? Oh, we actually completed it now. Okay. That actually was it. Okay, so we can warp from here to... Where, exactly? Can we... Tap to zoom with that? Okay, I, we can't, didn't seem to be able to, but... Um, which one do we want to go to? I kind of want to go there, so I guess the Valley of the Wind is the most logical warping location. There probably is some hidden secret somewhere in the Valley of the Wind as well. But I guess we will see. Is that also Valley of the Wind? Yeah, oh, that actually is still Valley of the Wind, the water down there. So that could be a good explanation on why that would not be completed yet. Interesting, interesting. Very interesting, actually. There's nothing much interesting there. Of course there isn't. Maybe up there? Nah, not really. Not really the right kind of place, to be honest. I can't believe how long I haven't been in this area at all. Well, in some of the areas in the game. That is a strange stump, but seems to go somewhere. But it doesn't seem to in end do much. I wonder if there's any hidden areas to the left here, considering the way the map forms. Yes, there is, but we already got that, so that doesn't matter to us much. And we just floated in air because of wrong hitbox making. <laughs> okay, so the water is to the left, to the right here. That's also blocked. Why is that blocked? How do we unlock those gates? Because there's clearly a way to, to get around this. Does it have to do with... I wonder if that has to do with um, some of the power-ups you can get. Interesting. So I guess we're just going to go the normal uh, stuff that we can actually get so down straight down here. Then if we go a bit through the maze left, maybe there's actually a hidden passageway through that. I wonder. I'm going to check for that to make sure. Oh, no, there's no hidden passageway here. That would not make much sense. At least. Nah, that wouldn't make too much sense. So, we can now get that one. I actually know how to get that one as well. Oh, we can open this. That opened a whole new area. I am going to check that out after I get the energy point that's there, which I know how to access from here. Like that. 
What's next in the ability cell? Let's save here and get that one. Well, that doesn't really create new attacks, so it doesn't really matter. Whoa, whoops. Sorry. Okay, let's see what we can do to the left here. Okay, so that's a stone. I'm just going to kill you all because you are not of use to me. Um, to the right there is stuff to do as well. Let's first check to the right here. I have never ever while playing this game seen this area specifically. That is a strange one. It's like the same kind of lantern that it was a special place for on the right and the other thing. Wait, another one of these gates? Why? How are they controlled? When will they unlock? Is this something from the new expansion? I'm going to search how those gates unlock as soon as this episode is over, so I can probably uh, get the most of that next time. I actually need to go back up because we need the rock to block that stream. Now suddenly that rock makes a whole lot more sense. Okay, so there's a blue point there, which we can probably get by pushing this rock down. Whoa, that quite nearly killed me. Come on, this is going to take me ages. Ah, why slow mechanics, why slow mechanics. So yeah, that is actually the way to get that. Okay. Good. I found an energy cell. Maze balls. And there's another one there in the water, but we cannot seem to get to that yet because of the same things I already talked about. I will look at how, what, and why those things are and function as. Don't worry, I will. Sometime. So it's up to the right, there was... Was there like something up to the right? At the... I think that's a map stone, right? What the, what's the here? Yeah. Okay, I don't think there was anything up here. But there might be. Oh, it's just a preview that there is a thing there. Okay. No, nothing there. Do those actually cost blue points? Oh, thank god they don't. Okay, so let's head left and see if we can get that one down there. Wait, I actually want to know what power-ups I have now, but I guess I have to wait a bit for that because of reasons. Oh, crikey. Give me that. Thank you. What's up there? Pretty easy now. I think that's everything in this area, is it? No, there's more stuff in the sunken glades because that is also part of it, of course. And that is also all part. Is that all sunken glades? Wow. That's Hollow Grove, of course. Okay, so I guess we're going to work our way back towards the spawn area now. Because there is more secrets to uncover in that. But I'm probably going to cut the episode here so I can, for next time, do some research on uh, on how to get all the stuff we haven't gotten yet that we could probably get. Because I kind of want to 100% the game for some reason. Oh, it's funny those things actually swing. I didn't realize the first time I played through this. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to save here. I hope you guys all enjoyed the episode and that my voice didn't sound too bad. I know this episode was kind of tedious. This is kind of an episode you could have skipped. I will include that in the title that this episode is optional and not specifically canon because we are just looking at all the side stuff we can get right now anyway i still hope you guys all enjoyed the episode and i'll see you guys in the next video bye bye